case has been um, strongly supportive. Um, we we joined very recently. We joined in, in 2020. Uh, we were not only very well welcomed in our uh, physical events the, in London in the beginning of 2020, and uh, we, we we felt very welcome there. And um, but also throughout the year, Case has um, supported us. Um, linking us, we, we have had a few challenges regarding press coverage of some of our relations with donors and the senior team in case uh, has supported us, linking us to the right people that can give us advice on previous experiences in having similar situations. Um, secondly, uh, case and the case library team and, um, and a few individuals that um, that were appointed to us within the CASE network were able to support us in the development of a new governance structure for our relation with donors uh, with a new code of conduct and a lot of documentation that CASE has an example as a benchmark that we heavily used uh, to our CASE and to develop our um, fundraising governance regarding the university and our um, important donors and also um, in terms of not only how to connect with donors, but also how to maintain the relations and the rules we should follow. So I think CASE has been tremendously uh, uh, supportive of our fundraising, um, um, our fundraising efforts in the sense that it has helped designing the teams or designing the processes adequately to to the needs of a proper fundraising team. I've actually recommended to all of our schools within the university to use more the case resources than they have been using because uh, I think um, uh, I was missing case because in the past I used to do fundraising for the business school for a while um, and then I had to, to create this team, the central team for the university and um, of course having case as a as a benchmark for fundraising has been tremendously helpful on that.